Hi ho, es geht weiter mit Let's Play Tales of Berseria. Beim letzten Mal sind wir nach Logos gelaufen. Und haben mit Leuten gequatscht. Und im, im Grunde ist kein Plot passiert, sind wir mal ehrlich. Aber egal, es war trotzdem witzig und wir sehen immer noch witzig aus. Witzig bis besteuert. Hi. Will the High Priest return to us? Keep this between us, but I heard Lord Gideon was killed by demons. Surely that's not true. It most certainly is true. Hey, shh, they'll hear you. I know someone who works in the palace, and he said the demon was a girl with the head of a wolf and the body of a gorilla. But how could a demon have gotten into the palace? Apparently, there was a power struggle among the higher-ups, and Gideon's enemies snuck the demon into his villa. They say that's why people sometimes heard terrifying screams coming from the place. Oh, is the demon still there? No idea. Rumor says she escaped, but I wouldn't worry. There's no way she'd stick around here. That's what you think. She's right here, so you'd better watch out. Stop messing around already. Ach, Magiru. Hier legt's halt schon drauf an, ne? <lacht> ah, ist da oben beim Händler was? Ah, einfach nur neben dran. Okay. The nights are so cold of late. It's gotten harder to get flamestone too. I hear the port at Halavis is at a near standstill. No matter how much flamestone they mine from Mount Killeraus, they can't get it shipped out. I'm sure the Abbey is aware of the situation. It's not just us who are suffering. We have to endure. Times like these is when we need to practice Lord Artorius's teachings. The many outweigh the individual. Exactly. I'm sure Lord Artorius will think of us soon and send aid. He doesn't give a damn about any of you. How dare you! The many outweigh the individual, right? Artorius wants to save humanity as a whole. Your individual troubles aren't important to him. You have no idea what you're talking about. Aren't we part of the whole he wants to save? What happy fools. Sorry about that. She didn't get to see his speech, so she's been taking it out on everyone around her. Really? What a troublesome kid. But really, that speech was incredible. Jo, dann sind eigentlich die Kräuter nachgewachsen? Wahrscheinlich nicht, die wachsen irgendwie gefühlt nie nach. Auf zu Telefa! Eleanor, I need you to wait outside. The boss of the Bloodwings knows an exorcist is with us, but... Say no more. I'm sure they have clients who wouldn't appreciate their faces being known to the Abbey. Correct. Luffy said, you stay with Eleanor. Okay. I'll be back soon. My thanks for coming all this way. It's been a while. Would you care for a peach pie? What do you want? Oh. It would do you good to unwind every now and again, you know. Stretch a bow too far and its string is bound to snap. What do you want? <sighs> I would like you to escort this person out of the capital. Something smells about this. Literally. Where am I taking them? Somewhere the authorities can't reach them. Sounds nice. I could do with such a place myself. No joke. We've been looking for a place to lay low, but we haven't had any luck yet. Well, come to think of it, I've heard a rumor that it's been a while since the Abbey has had any contact from Titania. Prison Island. Titania? But I thought the Abbey was in direct control of that place. Has the situation there gotten that bad since you left? Sometimes the answer is right under your nose. I think it might work. Yeah. Could make a decent hideout, actually. The Therians could definitely get their fill of malevolence there. And the Abbey is far too goody-goody to imagine an escaped prisoner would ever return to her prison by her own free will. At the very least, I'd say it's worth checking out. I take it our intel has proven useful? It has. But before we go, have you heard anything about the Abbey harboring demons? I'm aware there was a demon in the villa, and that it has been relocated. Where? I can't say right this moment, but I'm sure we will find out shortly. All right, then in exchange for this passenger's safety, 
I want more information on that demon. You've got a deal. Aizen, I heard about your confrontation with Melchior. I'm sorry I wasn't able to help you find him. Yeah, you really blew that one, toots. It's fine. What's done is done. Have you given up on finding Eifried? No, I haven't. The crew and I will do whatever we can to quash the Abbey's plans. We do them enough damage, and the Abbey ought to start thinking about putting their hostage to good use. They'll set him up as a trap for us, and that's when we'll steal him back. Attacking the Abbey to create an opening for his escape. Clever. It's what Ifrib would do. That's all. They're taking a while. Yeah. The Shepherd has a special mission for you. You are to protect the Malak Lafiset and bring him to the Logris Abbey headquarters. <laughs> What's wrong? Hey, you want to take a walk around the capital for a bit? I can show you some of the sights. But, um... You... You can't trust me. I understand. No, it's not bad. I promise. I'd love to go sightseeing with you, Eleanor. Luffy said. Uh, well, we'll do it another time, okay? Why? It's just, you know, Velvet would get mad at us. Get mad about what? Ah, you're done. And who is this? A VIP entrusted to us by the head of the Blood Wings. We're stowing them away on Titania, where the bad guys can't get at them. The prison island? Just who is this person? Didn't ask. What? <sighs> hey, something smells nice. Uh, uh huh? <laughs> Stop sniffing things. We're leaving. Aber, aber es I can't so believe gut hier. you take a job without bothering to ask who you're escorting or why. The less you know, the less trouble you invite. Erstmal Button mashen. Who is that caped man? I do not know, but his hawk seemed extraordinarily well trained. Trained to hunt, maybe? I'd imagine. It takes a great deal of time and money to train a bird like that. <laughs> What is it? I smell something nice. <laughs> Indeed. The scent is somehow familiar. <laughs> it can't be. Hmm? What are you two sniffing at? Aha! They're bloodhounds on the hunt! But we're talking about hawks hunting, aren't we? Come again? Oh, I'm sorry. Please excuse my poor manners. Huch. Ähm. So, Teltenia. Das bedeutet, wir benötigen ein Schiff. Hafen. Hafen klingt schon mal gut. Hm, Hafen bei Nacht. Uh. Mysteriös. Wir sind so auffällig in diesen Outfits. Das ist ein Wunder, dass es noch niemand geschnappt hat. Da ist ein Dude. Was will er uns erzählen? Could you fit my comedy act into tonight's show? I'm still breaking in my new partner, but I can carry the act. I'd appreciate you squeezing us in. For you, Maggie dear, I'll do it as a personal favor, but... You get 200 flat, no expenses, no per diem. Oh, come on, don't be so stingy. It gets worse. Our headliner is doubling up after, and the opener flubbed their lines and lost us minutes. Playing deuce for a cold house? 
Well, all right. Them's the breaks. What the hell are you even saying? I'm saying we're going on, and you are my straight man. What? You are serious? I'll take care of the actual funny bits. Just act like you always do and we'll be fine. Bonus points if you toss the men in the audience a glare of contempt every now and then. Just trust me. Oh, hold on. This is all happening so fast. I'm not sure I'm ready for... You'd better get ready, because the curtain's going up. Hi there! We're Moggy and Val, your lovely comedians for today! Magic Kazam! We're still new to the comedy business, but we'll do our best to give you a memorable show. Now, I'm Moggy, the bright beaming one in the pair, while my moody little partner here is... <laughs> Hey, what's wrong, Val? Everything okay? You need to put some energy into this or we're in trouble. Come on, if you've got one redeeming feature, it's your moxie. That might be, but this is different. I can see you're going through something right now. All right, let's take a deep breath together. <laughs> Excuse us for just one moment. Velvet, what are you doing? We're losing the audience. I... I can't help it. I've never talked in front of such a big crowd before. Wait, don't tell me... you've got stage fright? S so what if I do? That's so unlike you. Just pretend that you're fighting some nasty exorcist and give it some gusto. Easy for you to say. I'm embarrassed out here. Don't be such a girl! I am a girl! That's it! Just do that, but project your voice! I can't, and I don't want to. You're a comedian, you have to! Where's your passion for your newfound art? I'm not one, and I've never had any. No, I can see it within you, deep down, the burning passion of a true artist at heart! But I've had enough! I can't do this with you! <laughs> Sorry, folks, show's over. Well, you've certainly shown me something new. A comedy team that just stands on stage whispering to each other. We're going for a brand new comedic style. So, <laughs> what did you think? <sighs> Don't quit your day job. That's what I thought. Ah, now she plays the straight man. Yeah, that's uh, wirklich nicht ganz so überzeugend. Das müssen die beiden noch üben. This is bull crap. You're gouging us just because you can. Well, if you want to pay less, maybe you should go find someone more generous, hmm? Looks like they're at it again. for supplies and tell you what I'll give you a fair price actually just take what you need <sighs> we should all endeavor to help contribute to the common good of humanity rather than selfishly pursue wanton profit what uh, are you sure uh, uh, yeah. no Wait, what was I saying? You felt that too, didn't you, kiddo? Yeah, it disappeared, but I felt a strong force coming from somewhere to the north. It's called a domain, a Moloch's zone of influence. Wait, if it's north of here, then... The Empyrean's throne? Did that happen because of something Inominat and Artorius did? I don't know. I've got a bad feeling about this. We should get far away from here, and quickly. So... the suppression... Okay, no, oh! Uh, that's off -putting. But our job with Tabitha comes first. And we need a hideout soon, too. True enough. Ganz schnell weg, aber erstmal noch hier lauschen. Hey, Geezer, you alright? 
What nonsense are you spouting, youngin? That's one spirited old man. Well, it's just that you suddenly got all polite on me, and you were all like, Oh no, good chum, worry not about your debt to me. I thought I said stop spouting nonsense. It's not nonsense. You did say it. I heard you say it. He did. But we were all acting strangely. You said, after you, fine sir. And I said, no, 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 I simply couldn't. You first, dear friend. There's no way in hell I would ever let you go first. Come to think of it, that's right. But he said not to worry about our debts and now he's taking it back? That's inhuman, cruel, ruthless. They lost control of themselves, but still have their memories. Maybe something was manipulating them. What in the world happened to us? I don't get it, but what I do get is that he said we don't owe him nothing. So my debt to you is off, right, old man? Same here, same here. Shut your traps. I'd be flat broke if I let you knuckleheads off the hook. Now shut up and pay up. Something really strange happened here. Seems so. And I think this is just the beginning of it. Okay, dann nicht sie weg hier. Ich sollte vielleicht mal speichern. Ich sollte vielleicht zwischendurch Speicher, Speicher. So, hier. Flop, speichern. Okay. Ben weg! Lass uns gehen! All right, we're safely on the rolling waves. Don't you think it's time you showed us your face, mystery monk? <laughs> You're right. My apologies. I knew it! Prince Percival! Percival Ilmid Asgard. Crowned prince and heir to the throne of the Midgan Kingdom. So he's next in line, is he? It looks like someone already had me figured out. Yes, your highness. I could tell from your fragrant wood scent, as only the royal family may wear it. But if I may ask, why? Must I explain myself to gain your aid? I myself could ask what an exorcist is doing consorting with members of the underworld. I... I don't... It doesn't matter why you're here. On this ship, you're here for us to use to our advantage. Treat me as you will. It's not like I can ever go back. For a fellow born with silver spoons spewing out of his mouth, Princey Pooh is rather laid back. Prince Percival is an upstanding man, renowned for both his intelligence and his fair, just demeanor. It's widely believed that with him on the throne, Midgan's prosperity will continue and... Look, I played dumb earlier, but I smelled that scent too. He wore it for us to notice. He wanted us to know just what sort of position he held, and how useful he could be to us. He surprised me, at least. Do you think we're being led into another trap? We definitely can't take that possibility off the table. When the time comes, he'll make a good hostage, if nothing else. Not if the ones we face are after his life, too. For now, let's just make sure we keep an eye on him. The prince. He said he couldn't go back. I wonder why. The whole island's a prison. It's like a secret fort or something. Weirdly quiet, though. Yeah, I don't see a single exorcist on watch. Hmm. <laughs> Let's scope out the inside. Hello, Prince. Das war Teil des Plans. Wessen Plans? Oh, das ist alles aus dem Fels herausgehauen worden. Es wirkte ja wie eine Festung und nicht wie ein Gefängnis. Aber in jedem Fall war es höllisch viel Arbeit. Diese Haut ist total unheimlich. Ich kriege eine richtige Gänsehaut. Gecko-Haut? <lacht> ich fürchte mich nicht. 
Nicht allzu sehr. Okay, das ist gut. Fang bloß nicht an zu weinen. Ich finde es sehr anstrengend, wenn du weinst. Deine Stimme ist super anstrengend, wenn du weinst. Oh, meine Güte. So, ich möchte andere Outfits. Ich möchte andere Outfits. Was haben wir denn noch nicht? Was hatten wir noch nicht? Was hatten wir noch nicht? Die Winterkleidung heben wir uns auf, bis wir wieder ein Schneegebiet haben. Hatten wir schon alles? Ich bin für Dienstmädchen. Dienstmädchen. Ähm, Dina. Okay. Die bescheuerten Accessoires lasse ich mal noch nur ein, zwei Parts. Schauen wir mal. Die Dina-Kleidung. Komm, wir sind die Dina vom Prinzen. Das passt doch, oder? So. Dina-Kleidung. 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 Oder ist es Zeit für andere bescheuerte Accessoires? Haben wir irgendwelche Dina-Outfits? Zylinder. Zylinder? Und Monokel? Machen wir mal voll einheitlich. Oh, wir haben sogar die Bedienstetenschleife. Oh, warte. Ne? Aber mit Monokel, oder? Monokel. Oder jeder eine andere Brille. Ich und meine Brille, ich weiß. Ich weiß. Monokel. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Und du bekommst... Äh, wo waren diese Dienerschleifen? Waren die unten? Bediensteten. Nein, du bekommst eine Fliege. <lacht> Wie lässig sie da hängt. Okay. Bedienstetenfliege und... Was haben wir denn? Sonnenbrille, farbige Sonnenbrille, Piloten, schwarze Sonnenbrille. Du bekommst die schwarze Sonnenbrille. Du bekommst auch ein Schleifchen. Schleifchen, Schleifchen, Schleifchen. Schleifchen. Äh, und... Guck mal, die passt auch fast schon zu ihren... Fast zu ihren Haaren. Okay, du kannst deine Brille behalten. Du bekommst nur... Moment, da war es doch schon. Oh nein, nicht die Schleife. Die Fliege. Bitteschön. Du bekommst die Schleife. Hui. Schleife. Schleife. Wow. Die hängt sehr tief. Aber bei dem Ausschnitt kein Wunder. Ähm, farbige Sonnenbrille. Und Fliege. Und äh, Sonnenbrille. So, was haben wir jetzt? Sonnenbrille, farbige Piloten, farbige schwarze Sonnenbrille und Mon Mon Magilo sticht wieder raus. Wie immer. So gehört sich das. Oh. Button Mashen! Woo! Okay. An Exorcist. Are you all right? Headless Knight is back? Think this is the demon that attacked her? Hmm, another prison riot? Kurogane, dial. You two protect Kamoana and the Prince. Understood. Er sieht aber nicht sehr kopflos aus. I was just getting warmed up. So did the Abbey actually fail to quell the riot? I find that hard to believe. The prison was heavily staffed with exorcists. Perhaps it was venomization. Venomization? A dark ritual. Forcing demons to eat each other in order to produce ever stronger demons. So the demons devoured each other, creating a demon too powerful for the exorcists to control? I imagine the riot didn't help. Now whose fault could that have been, I wonder? Whatever happened doesn't matter to us now. We need to focus on how to take this place for ourselves. 
That exorcist from before said something about a headless knight, right? That one's probably the leader. Then we hunt it down and destroy it. Until we capture the island, let's use this room for our staging ground. I'll leave the Prince and Kamoana to you two. Eliminate any enemies who come in. Understood. Don't expect much from me, but all right. Kamoana, if anything happens, call for me and I'll come running to protect you, okay? Okay. You stay safe too, Eleanor. Let's go. Okay. Lasst uns speichern gehen und beim nächsten Mal den kopflosen, was auch immer, erledigen. Also dann, ciao, ciao.